if you're new to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now. Today, I am inspired to make another wedding arrangement, so today I'm gonna show you how to make a candelabra for an escort table. Here we go. making the base of the candelabra by using a small plate and five candle holders. I am going to be using my hot glue gun to stack these candelabras together. Uh, you can also use Gorilla Glue. That's actually a little more solid, uh, but it's just more time consuming because you have to wait half an hour, you know, as you stack them one by one. So I'm gonna be using my hot glue gun, but it's gonna be a little tricky because I don't want, you know, the spaces to be too thick in between. So I'm just gonna have to smooth it out as, smooth, as much as possible. So, all right, here I go. like it belongs together because he does all right get this glue off of me look at that I ruin all my clothes that's okay it's all for the art right all right so see there you have it all in one piece for the other half of the candelabra or the top part you are going to need a dinner plate and five of the candle holders and a floral foam. I was gonna use this one, but I decided to go uh, for this one. All right, so I am going to be gluing four of the candle holders um, across from each other on top right here on the edges. And then I'm gonna be gluing the floral foam to the middle and then I'm going to be gluing the last candle holder to the top of the floral foam. I'm gonna start with the floral foam first. Should have taken this out. Preparation is everything, folks. Preparation is everything. I'm mostly prepared. I gotta work on that. Mostly is not totally, so I gotta get it together. Next, I'm gonna glue the candle holders opposite side of each other, um, right here on the edge of the plate with the help of a little piece of foam, the real flower foam. Uh, you can cut this in little pieces and then you're gonna add it to the bottom here. you do have to make sure that the stents are long because you want the flowers to stick out further than the plate so cut it as long as you can and if you need to cut it a little 
more that you can do so. These are the ones that I bought the most of and then everything else I have less of. So I'm just gonna bunch a few of them together and just going to, it has four sides. So I'm going to put, you know, four bunches around the candelabra or around the foam. Now I'm filling in the gaps with some white hydrangeas right here in the middle. So for these, you do have to cut the stems shorter for the inside. And um, it's already looking nice, right? All right, I'll be back in a little bit to show you the progress. This is what I have so far. I added some roses. I added this um, deeper purple in between colors to break it up. And then I added this cattail sticking out as well as this one sticking out of the arrangement. Now I have to, I'm going to hot glue these so they won't, oh, I'm gonna put that one back. Um, I'm going to hot glue these to cover the candle holders here on the side and then I'm gonna add some roses on top of here so you can see this kind of holder. I love it pretty and now I'm going to add the candles this is so gorge gorgeous I'm gonna get married again now and There you have it. I'm so excited. So pretty. So, so pretty. So, now it's time to put it on the base. All right. Ooh, ooh. to the side for now and this is not heavy it's actually I think I'll just leave it alone okay now it's time to glue these two together so let's do that here's the finished product is amazing very elegant, very beautiful. I mean, I'm in love with it. I'm in love with it. Uh, I will put the candles on them once I move it to the table. But before I do that, I wanna tell you that if you are going to use this arrangement on your reception tables, you have to glue it with the Gorilla Glue. It will take you about three hours just to do this one but if you're gonna have it in the reception table where people are gonna be sitting, you, don't, you do not wanna use the hot glue gun because it will come apart if somebody touches it. So for this uh, arrangement, I use the hot glue gun because I'm only gonna use it on a card table, an escort card table, which is usually like pushed back and nobody will be messing with it. So, I mean, it's still secure enough, but still for safety reasons, you want to use the Gorilla Glue and really take your time for the glue to set. All right, guys, this is it, and I will see you next time. Bye.